Hello everybody and welcome back to another session from Mulgai and the heart of Scotland. Today we'll have a quick look at the Ford Falcon of Australia and also the Hillman Imp. Because Mulgai town centre has come to a, come to a halt really because of this, all these classic cars here in uh, Mulgai today. Indeed we're back at the classic car show held in the centre of town. We'll highlight two cars today because there's a lot to choose from but let's have a look at the Ford's Falcon and also the Hillman Imp Caledonian. This is the Ford Falcon two-door hardtop model. I can hear it. The ground is rumbling. Oh that is sweet. That is nice. Touring car driver Alan Muffet won the 1976 oh. Australian Touring Car Championship driving. Falcon GT XB hardtop. Now let's change the pace back to 1976 when Levi Stay Press was the order of the day. Harrington's with tartan lining, Doc Martin's and Arthur Black shirts were the order of the day. Yes indeed, this is the 1976 Hillman Imp Caledonian. The Caledonian is truly something special and today it's surrounded by some precious metal, some American muscle, there's three Porsches there, there's one of the biggest Rolls Royce cars you've ever seen but it's the Hillman Imp that's capturing the attention. Way back in 1976 Chrysler were coming to the end of their production run and wanted to put some incentives to move a few more models. The special patterned red cloth seats, push button radio, reclining front seats, door mirrors, reversing lights, the attractive side stripe and decorative rear panel with overriders on the bumper are all seen as special additives to the Imp Caledonian. Let's not forget those special sunbeam wheel trims. However, I enjoyed chatting to Alex all about the car and um, there are 25 of the original 2000 Caledonian imps that still survive and around 8 of these are roadworthy. OAW was registered in March 1976 as the Hillman Imp Caledonian ceased production in mid-1976. The car had been dry stored since 1993 and Alex acquired the car in 2013. OAW was restored by Clark Dawson in 2015-2016 who is an acknowledged uh, mark expert. It was a bare shell restoration. There's also been some upgrades with modern disc brakes at the front of the car. The car is looked after by Winlinton Garage of Irvine, which is a classic car heaven and serviced and maintained according to the book and it's just past 50,000 on the clock. We didn't even get around to talking about the starting handle for the Hillman Imp Caledonian. Anyway, I hope you've enjoyed what we've seen here at Mulgai today. There's more on our playlist from myself, Stable. Toot toot, peep peep. See ya.